And I think we're all glad these companies decided to move their businesses here before today's weather. It was miserable outside, cloudy, cold, and wet, very unmay like. But tonight, the rain is moving out, the clouds are on their way out. Sunshine returns tomorrow and so do warmer temperatures. But listen, it's not warm out right now. Beautiful shot from Shaw University looking at downtown Raleigh where it's 44 degrees. Central North Carolina was one of the coldest spots in the whole country today. That includes Alaska. Remember, we're 44 right now. The current temperatures in a good portion of Alaska are warmer than our 44. So that just goes to show you how silly today's temperatures were. We return to our regularly scheduled May weather tomorrow. Although it starts off chilly, 42 degrees, some of us in the upper 30s. And we'll have a few clouds here and there. Won't be perfectly sunny, but definitely a lot more sun than we saw today. And there's no rain tomorrow. Now, temperatures will climb up to 62 around lunchtime on our way to a high near 70. But remember, the middle of May, our average high is near 80. So while it will be significantly warmer tomorrow, we're still a little bit below average. And since we did not see any sunshine today, I want to thank Chris out in Holly Springs last week for getting up early for this super sunrise. Beautiful shot there. Some ominous looking clouds. We had plenty of those today. Sun's coming up these days, by the way, at 612 AM. I will not see that tomorrow morning. But if you want to see this picture and all my super sunsets and sunrises from the past few years, check out Weather West on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram. So here's the deal with today's weather. We had a cold northerly flow, thanks to high pressure, and we had a passing area of low pressure that brought us the clouds and the rain. Well, all of that starts to move tomorrow. And so our weather changes, it improves. And here's what the radar and satellite will look like by tomorrow morning, 6 a.m. Most of the clouds are gone, but it doesn't stay that way all day long. As you can see, a few clouds start to sneak back in here in the afternoon and notice they're coming from the north. So that northerly flow is still kind of there. We just have some sunshine to counter it. So no rain tomorrow, but we could see a couple of sprinkles, light showers on Friday. So here we are Friday at 7 a.m. So we wrap up the work and school week again, a decent amount of sunshine until we get into the afternoon. A few extra clouds show up again, and this time could bring a few sprinkles with it. That's around dinner time, so obviously not a washout. Most of us won't get anything, but there could be a few drops. And that's a big deal because Friday, Saturday, and Sunday, we've got a handful of commencement ceremonies. Meredith, NC State, UNC, Nash Community College, Wake Forest over in Winston. Everyone having their commencement ceremonies, most of them outside, so this forecast becomes important. 69 tomorrow. Friday, we're in the low 70s, mid-70s on Saturday, and Sunday, we stay around 75 with a small chance of rain late in the day. Then we crank up the dial just a little bit on the thermostat, and we're back into the 80s on your 10-day forecast next week, and that includes a few small chances of rain. All right, that's a look at your forecast, and I ask Alyssa, are you ready for some football?